my people still on father's day wahala hmm. as we all know on father's day david Doe wrote on his easter story that it is very difficult for him to celebrate this father's day to the extent someone even come out and say which one be emotional blackmail when they do with a son with by say you should cut off all those stones hmm. you guys it is not ending there as kemi or new lawyer don't come out can't talk waiting they really happen we make david do no film move on for a song with by hey you guys she also said that is the main reason why sophia momodu and hildi the black milam on top in Peking with by hey, hey you guys it is not easy like this is so shocking and unbelievable as we all know kemi on lawyer has been coming out to say a whole lot of things the other day she said them um, we should ask sophia and hildi they no waiting by davido and chioma son if i may he so continue to rest in peace hmm. as we see they talk about that one hmm. davido can't talk say it is so difficult for him to celebrate father's day say what that's still for in eyes but he has to be strong for his darling wife chioma now so came me on new lawyer commas can't talk say a message to davido and the first sense of belonging when they talk about in some way by say make davido come out plainly can't explain to all his fans all over the world waiting really by in some because as it is like this say davido is not telling his fans the truth say me could go ask um sophia momodu and hildi say they know waiting by if i and now waiting made them the use and they blackmail davido you guys hey can me really spill a whole lot like hmm, this thing is getting deeper and we think my people relax grab your popcorn because all the truth is going to be spilling in this particular video about what really happened to Ifai, Chioma and David Oson, waiting by that little boy. May he so continue to rest in peace. But before they make a hell on our first, hello guys and welcome back to Nene Space TV. Thank you for always tuning in. Thank you for always coming back to watch my video. I greet you all according to your time. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. Please do want to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification bell. So you be notified whenever i drop a new video to my returning subscribers you guys are the real deal thank you for your love for your support towards my channel i really appreciate you all to my new subscribers i see all welcome to the next space tv here we talk about celebrity gist mostly our favorite couple david and chema and all the trending gist please go through our videos we see one or two that will interest you and don't forget to turn on your post notification bell so you will not miss out on any of my updates so my lovely people hmm, like i said it was Father's Day and Davido could not celebrate it, not because he doesn't have other kids, but because the loss of his son, his late son, Ifai, still pain him to his bone marrow. And he said, it would be so difficult for me to celebrate this Father's Day, water still for my eyes, but I will remain strong for my darling wife. Not just that, and also Davido granted an interview where he said he is building a mansion for him and Chioma in a atlantic hmm. that was what triggered them um, kemi on new lawyer now so she come out come the talk say dear david adeleke but david why are you lying on social media you don't need validation from anyone the banana island mansion you built and had a birthday for ifai and now selling according to the daft mainstream media in nigeria who says where his son drone is still questionable David, this house is owned by Sujimoto and he does promos for his houses and rich celebrities who live there for a specific amount of time. Ijibomi Ogundele owns that house. Be transparent with your fans. Fake news, news suppression, misinformation and lies have by news in Nigeria. David, you lied to your fans. Had a housewarming party. Even had Ifain's third birthday dear. Don't give false impression. Don't seek clout. Many of your fans want to be like you, rich. Too many people 
people have this false sense of belonging. Everyone will attack my post, but I care less because I am the most intelligent woman in Nigeria and the best investigative journalist. So you guys, Kemi or Niloyo is just like trying to tell us that as the talk say, if fine, may you so continue to rest in peace, was drawn. Say there is nothing of such. Say make David do come out plain. Can't tell him fast. Waiting really happened to late if I in his son. Hmm. She also go as far as saying, hands down, I don't compete with the truth. I share intelligency and that makes me the best. Most intelligent people don't share secrets of their sources. Finally, David, why did Banana Island Estate tell their residents that nobody drawn in any residence of their estates? Where is Ifai and what happened to him? Why didn't your record label PR and family spoke person announced what happened to him and you choose a police spokesman for a public figure as big as you with an oil magnet and a governor in your family why is your nanny and cook still in police custody since november 2022 why haven't you asked the same lagos police to update the public on that there are many unanswered questions now you are bragging about yet another audio house why is Sophia and Hilde trying to blackmail you with information about Ifai? You deserve privacy, as your fans say, but public figure who announces car, home, jewelry, etc., more than their work, have no privacy. I am doing my work. I am a journalist and the only one who practices without favor in Nigerian news market. And those, why I ended up the poorest and had a crowd fund my work. The truth sets you free. Hmm. You guys, you all have heard what Kemi or New Lawyer says about David O and his late son. I think Kemi has been spilling a whole lot like it is just so many and many people are saying that why is davido and his family not doing anything towards all this thing where kemi or no lawyer they spill for social media does it mean that kemi passed them but you guys according to kemi she said she is so close to davido's family meaning she knows most of the things that happens in their home and ever since this ifani matter has happened and Kemi has been dragging Davido and um, Chioma to the, to the extent she talks, say Davido can never get married to Chioma. And when Davido got married to Chioma, she switched. She changed her ways. As in, Kemi is not somebody people believe. But the way people are saying is true that Davido should come out and say what happened to his son. Which parents will come out and tell you this is what happened to my late son? If you look at Davido's recent interview, we know that that dude is still hot on what happened to his son. So it is fine if you don't want to come out publicly to say anything about what happened to his son. Nobody is even expecting him to say anything because he has confirmed that his son is late. So what more does Kemi or Nulo your want? Even when people are saying that, does it mean that Davido cannot get her arrested or something? She said them. Um, um, David O's father wanted and their lawyer said if he does that, he will be messing everything like he will put them in a big mess. All I believe is this if there is anything that Kemi or the lawyer need to say let her bring proof. She can't just be spilling without any evidence let her bring proof to back her words up. That is all I can say because this thing is really getting deeper than we think she has come out. This is not the first time she has been coming out to say that David o should tell the public what really happened to his late son, Ifai. To me, if there is any evidence, both Sophia and Hildy, they should bring it out. They should stop blackmailing the young man. That is all I can say. So, my lovely people, that is the latest update. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching. See you all in my next one. Bye for now.